During this month of February, Black History Month is celebrated. Each year, this is observed in order to recognize and commemorate the significance of Black history as well as understand both the past and present experiences of African Americans in the United States and around the world. Here at West Texas A&M University, it is important to study the history on campus and recognize how those from the past have blazed the trail and inspired others. The first African-American student to attempt enrolling at West Texas State College was G.R. Tomlin. Tomlin was seeking to receive a master's degree in education in order to obtain a higher teaching position at the Amarillo Air Force Base. The Board of Regents would go on to maintain segregation in schools, so unfortunately, Tomlin would not be able to attend. Another attempt would be made in 1959 by John Matthew Shipp Jr. to enter West Texas State. After being denied twice, Ship would file a lawsuit and after an extensive process, Ship would ultimately be allowed to attend. However, West Texas State managed to deny Ship long enough to miss registration for the semester, so he would go on to attend college in Dallas. The first African American to attend West Texas State was Helen Neal in 1961. She would also go on to be the first African American graduate with a Bachelor's of Science in Secondary Education. Others such as Betty J. Thomas and Marvel White would shortly join after. Many years would pass and the number of African Americans attending WTAMU would increase starting in the 1960s. History would be made once again when Nathaniel Neal, husband to Helen Neal, would ultimately become the first African American professor at WT in 1971. And in 1996, Claudia Stewart would become the first female African American faculty member. Flashing forward to today, there are many organizations and resources that represent diversity within the WTAMU community, such as the Black Student Union, the Black Women's Association, the African Student Organization, and the Office of Diversity and Inclusion. While WT has come a long way from its past, it's imperative that we continue to recognize the importance of Black history and make strides towards a more inclusive future. This is Alyssa Gonzalez reporting for the Prairie News.